Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In this very short video, we are going to see how can we use calculator to perform basic calculations of complex numbers like addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division. In this short video, we are going to see how can we use calculator to do addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division using the calculator and how can we convert Cartesian form to complex number and other way around using the calculator. I'm using calculator FX 991 Casio calculator. So let's do the first step. First step is mod. Second option complex number. Now we are in the complex menu. Now we are going to store these complex numbers in our fixed memory. So let's focus on the very first complex number which is 4 minus 3 iota. So 4 minus 3 for iota I'll press this ENG button. So this is a complex number. So shift and then RCL key. This will allow me to substitute this value 4 minus 3 iota in one of the memories. I'm choosing this A. Now this A is being stored in the fixed memory A. Similarly, let's substitute the other one. 1 minus 2 iota shift rcl then plus p the second number is stored in b uh, now let's store one more 1 plus iota shift rcl and now c now we have stored three complex numbers in our complex menu i have already done the uh, calculations for you now we are going to double check it with the help of calculator first of all let's add the two complex numbers so alpha a alpha and a key plus alpha b a plus b equals to 5 minus i order. so this is addition of two complex numbers similarly if we want to subtract these two a minus alpha b the subtraction result is 3 minus iota. You see it is 3 minus iota. Now similarly, let's do the multiplication. Uh, alpha. Then we have A times B. Or we can simply write AB equals to minus 2 minus 11 iota. This is the product of two complex numbers. Similarly, now let's do the division. A. It's a over B so the, after division we have 2 plus iota so it's very easy to do the uh, basic addition subtraction multiplication or division using the calculator okay now let's find out the argument of complex number A uh, A uh, first of all you just go to this complex menu complex menu 2 number 1 choose the argument and whatever complex number you want to find, let's substitute a value over here. So the argument of this is minus 0 0.4644. Similarly, you can find its length as well. Length is, you can find the conjugate as well. 2 plus 2 and then conjugate of the very first complex number. You can enter b as well. Let's say b. Conjugate of b is 1 plus 2 iota. Now, <clears throat> one important thing, that if you want to convert this complex number A into polar form, so you have number 3 option, number 3 option equals, now the 5, 5 represent its magnitude, length, and this angle sign, after that angle sign is the argument. So the complex number A in terms of polar form is 5 and the argument is minus 0.6. For 4. Let's do it once more for B. Now B is a complex number. I want to convert it into polar form number 3. So this is being converted. Very easy, very simple steps. Or you can just type in any complex number. You, you don't have to store it in some memory. Let's say if it is 5 plus 5 iota and you want to convert shift to number 3. So this is the complex number 5 square root 2 is the length and pi over 4 is the argument.
convert this back and forth we can convert any uh, exponential number into polar form as well let me root 2 right arrow then this shift minus sign this angle means you are supposed to write over here the argument so shift pi over 4 this is the argument we're pressing so we get polar form or exponential form being converted into Cartesian form so guys it's very easy so you should use calculator in the paper as well so that you get 100% marks in this conversion in addition subtraction and all things like that in the next video we will we will talk about how can we find out the square root cube root or fourth root of any complex number whether it is given in Cartesian form or in polar form particularly if it is in Cartesian form so stay tuned and see you in the next video till then